Joe, welcome to Melbourne. How's the first week been so far? Uh, it's been pretty, pretty tough, you know. Um, the boys have been treating me good, uh, like family, new family. So all the brothers saying, introducing themselves and, you know, um, showing me their paths, so it's good. You obviously spent a little bit of time in the Super League a couple of years. What are you expecting is going to be different about the NRL? Um, obviously, it's, a little, it's going to be more challenging, I guess, um, for, for myself. It's going to be a mental tough game, but, um, you know, it'll be a good challenge for myself. So, yeah. Is that part of the reason coming over here is to challenge and take that next step? I'd, not only that, I wouldn't say that, but it's also a big dream of mine to play in the NRL. Um, such a high level and, yeah, so my dream myself, yeah. You're not too unfamiliar to purple. You, your dad pulled on the purple jersey back in the mid-2000s. Uh, what, have, I guess, have you heard about the club from him and, and his experience here? Uh, he's he's al always told me that um, it's such a good place. It's very difficult, but when you come out of pre-season, you're, you're a better man on the field and off the field, you're... And, and like the better men as well, so it's good. And I guess your goals for initially pre-season and then, then the year ahead, what are you setting yourself up for? Uh, my goals myself, um, obviously, make my debut for the, um, this year in the NRL. Um, and yeah, just, you know, just obviously creating new friends and family over here, so it'd be good. Is there anyone that you've uh, buddied up to pretty quick? Um, Eli, uh, Kato, or Toko. Um, yeah, because we've been started at the same time, so butted up real good with him. But yeah, it's good. Thanks, Joe. Welcome to Storm, and good luck for the rest of the preseason. Thanks, brother.